And India may now start testing cough syrups at government labs just before exporting. Now, this comes after Indian cough syrup allegedly killed 300 children in Gambia, Indonesia and Uzbekistan. So, big decision that India might now start testing cough syrups before uh, exporting at the government labs. Remember, this comes after Indian cough syrups allegedly killed 300 chil children in Gambia, Indonesia and Uzbekistan. And after that, a big decision has been taken that India will now be testing the cough syrups before exporting them. CNN News 18's Himani is joining us. Himani, can you tell us why this decision has uh, been taken by in Indian government to test the cough syrups before exporting them? Right, right. So the latest uh, move is uh, driven by multiple allegations leveled by importers of uh, Indian medicines, including, you know, countries like Uzbekistan, Gambia, and uh, Marshall Islands and Micronesia, where made in India cough syrups was found contaminated with the toxic chemicals. So now this proposal is to test the finished goods at government labs before exporting. So government has identified few labs where these samples can be tested just before, you know, they, they can be exported. This includes labs at Indian Pharmacopoeia Commission and six other CDSEO network labs based in Chandigarh, Kolkata, Chennai, Hyderabad, Mumbai and Guwahati. Apart from these labs, uh, these samples can also be tested at NABL accredited drug testing labs uh, of the state government, according to the uh, proposal. And, uh, you know, the proposal also says that exporter will have to produce the certificate of analysis of these batches being uh, exported from one of the approved labs along with other documentation for the release of the consignment for uh, export. So now uh, CDSCO, has, CD, CDSCO has requested the health ministry to take the call on this proposal. And, uh, uh, and the government official has also told us that these incidences that have taken place in Uzbekistan, Gambia, <coughs> uh, have caused embarrassment. And, you know, these incidents have raised doubts on otherwise very excellent manufacturing capabilities of India, because of which India was uh, also known as, is also known as pharmacy to the world. So this is the reason that, you know, government has been planning to intervene and trying to overhaul this entire system uh, due to which the cup syrups have been blamed and, uh, you know, and a lot of countries have complained about the quality and contamination. Back to you. All right, Imani, thank you for those details.